Hello everyone. In this topic, we are going to essentially discuss about the chemical reactions of carbonyl compounds. In the first video of this particular topic, we will be discussing about nucleophilic addition reactions, which is the reactions undergone by carbonyl compounds. Let us see why. When we are discussing about the structure of carbonyl compounds, we saw that carbonyl compound is actually planar in nature as it has sp2 hybridization state. We also saw that due to the electronegative nature of oxygen, it withdraws electron density from the pi bond towards itself such that a positive charge is developed on carbon atom and a negative charge is developed on oxygen atom. So because of this, this becomes a nucleophilic center whereas carbon here becomes an electrophilic center such that any electron rich species or a nucleophile can attack this particular carbon and bring about nucleophilic addition reaction. So as you can see in this, addition of a nucleophile takes place on the planar C double bond O group and what happens? The intermediate is nothing but a tetrahedral alkoxide ion. Why? Because here we have CO minus. And you can also note that hybridization state changes from sp2 of the carbonyl compound to sp3 hybridization state which is the tetrahedral uh, product here. You can also see that the net result of this nucleophilic addition reaction on the carbonyl compound is simply addition of a nucleophile and H plus across the C double bond door uh, giving us a final product. So let us quickly look at the mechanism of this reaction. You can see here we have a planar C double bond door group. It can be an aldehyde or a ketone and now you can see that the first step is a slow step where the intermediate is formed and you can see from here when nucleophile adds to the particular carbon which is electron deficient, pi electrons shift in this way such that we get this tetrahedral alkoxide intermediate. The second step is a very fast step where essentially hydrolysis takes place and gives us this final product which is the addition product. I hope you are very clear on what is the exact mechanism of nucleophilic addition reactions undergone by carbonyl compounds. Thank you.